Okay, Cancer. Hope you guys are doing well. So, Cancer, this is going to be for your Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Also, check your Jupiter, all right? Keep in mind, it won't resonate with every single Cancer that watches. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Personal readings in the description box, guys. Y'all are greatly appreciated. Too many of these came out, so I'm going to put them back. Um, yeah, hit that like, hit that subscribe, Cancer, if this resonates with you. And, uh, yeah, let's see what comes out for you guys. I'm not doing a specific love, but if love comes out, then, you know, I'm going to call like I see, of course. So we're starting off with grief, and it says, I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it. Okay, so Cancer, I feel like every time I pull these cards for you, it's, that comes out. Either grief or regret or something along the lines of that. <sighs> balance okay i it says uh i bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and i do so without judgment okay cancer i like that energy so far the energy is good this could also be someone around you as well grieving oh in love and it says, I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. Uh, okay, so Cancer, that's the um, overall energy we're going to see, though. Of course, as I'm shuffling, I shuffle the deck for you guys. This is what came out on top, the Five of Cups. So, um, let's see what comes out for you guys. So far, the energy is pretty good. I feel like you guys are becoming balanced. Um, or spirit is advising you to to become balanced. Some of you guys might be looking for um, more balance in your connections. Wow, the lovers, yes. Some of you guys might um, be around a Gemini, particularly an air sign, because the stars on the bottom, which is Aquarius. So two air signs, uh, Cancer. So wow, do we have a soulmate type situation going on? Let's see. Uh, okay, Cancer. Um, there we go. Okay, so Cancer, you have some type of choice. Two of Wands comes out. Or someone is trying to make the, uh, some type of choice. Um, could be you, Cancer. I'm going to pull some more and see what comes out. Yeah, ooh, the Four of Cups. Mm, with the Knight of Wands on the bottom. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. Are you not sure about one of your options, uh, Cancer? Take it how it resonates. We have the King of Wands and the Ace of Swords. Okay, so I'm getting fire sign vibes. It could be a Gemini or a fire sign. That's what I'm seeing. Um, I'm also getting Cancer. You have some type of decision to make. Um, outside of the love sector, I feel like you have a choice of some sort. It could be between lovers. Um, it could be between, um, business ideas too. Some of you guys have multiple business ideas and you're not really sure which direction to go. Some of you guys already own a business or you started a business and you're not quite sure, uh, where to take it. Um, cancer, take it how it resonates. I'm, with this four of cups here though cancer i'm getting that you're bored with something that you're doing or uh you're you're not you're not appreciating what you have this can also be someone around you too that's not appreciating you uh cancer you could be oh no way the ace of cups guys clarifying the lovers Okay, so this is going to be a love situation for the um, majority of whoever's watching, okay? Wow, Cancer. Anyway, what I was saying about the Four of Cups, I just completely got sidetracked. Um, someone around you might be taking you for granted or uh, took you for granted or something like that. Sometimes the Four of Cups, it can be boredom, but I feel like sometimes the Four of Cups can be ungratefulness as well, Cancer, all right? So they may not even be you, Okay. Six of Wands on the bottom of the deck. I'm getting fire sign vibes, guys. 
doesn't have to be but um yeah yikes okay so I'm not gonna take all these but um somebody's feeling some type of way cancer you always have somebody feeling some type of way um there we go the knight of we see the knight of wands again <sighs> yeah cancer someone is trying to decide if they want to come forward to you somebody's trying to decide if they want to come forward and give you this love offer the six of wands again on the bottom yes you might be getting a lot of attention right now, Cancer, or whoever this person is, is in the limelight of some sort. You see how she's like standing up with her hands up. She's like, it looks like she's in front of an audience a little bit. So I feel like this person might be in the limelight. They may get up a lot of attention. Um, might be very uh, like active on social media, if that makes sense cards going everywhere all right let's see what came out i'm getting oh i'm getting this person might have been a player uh cancer knight of swords oh yeah and the three of cups yeah under the king of wands three the three of cups under the king of wands guys yeah this is someone that's very popular uh cancer or it could be you you might be very popular but you have somebody around you that you dealt with before um, that has this in and out player energy. And I feel like the player energy is because they they do get a lot of attention, um, Cancer. They could have been, you know, doing the most too. They could have been like stepping out on you as well. Um, I'm seeing though that They see you as their person, but I, I, I still feel like there's some indecision here, and it could be on your end. The magician. Yeah. Someone's trying to manifest um, a reunion with you, Cancer. They might be watching you as well um, with the page of swords on the bottom. They may be trying to gather inf as much information as possible to uh, come forward and talk to you. Okay. Um... For some of you, though, hmm, you may not have dated this person. This might be a new person, uh, Cancer. That's the vibe that I'm getting. This might be a new person. This might not even be, take it how it resonates, Cancer, okay? But I feel like you have someone that is kind of sitting back, chilling, and waiting to make a move. Someone wants to make a move. And I feel like they may even be afraid that you might reject them. Let me pull some more clarifiers because I'm not quite sure if this is someone you've dealt with before or if this is just someone just sitting watching you. Someone that might be on your social media that follows you on your social media platform that wants to come forward and um, talk to you. I also feel like they're trying to manifest you talking to them as well. Someone's trying to manifest communication with you, Cancer. And I feel like you might be the one that gets all the attention and stuff on social media. But someone here gets a lot of attention, okay? Uh, they may even be afraid that you're a player, Cancer. And you have a whole lot of options. Take it how it resonates, okay? Um, yeah. Wow, guys. You can't be serious. Okay, so the Queen of Cups is on the bottom. That's y'all's energy. We have the four of wands, guys. Someone feels like you're their soulmate or you have a soulmate coming, Cancer. The queen of pentacles and the two of cups, guys. Yeah, y'all have a soulmate coming in. But I feel like this person may feel like, uh, this person feels like you might reject them. Yeah, they feel like you might reject them, Cancer. This person is popular. They're they're well known. Take it how it resonates. But they may have just they may just have a lot of followers on social media, whatever. Um, the King of Wands is very attractive. This is someone that's like very attractive. Lots of people find them attractive. You might be hesitant as well because I'm getting some confusion. You might be hesitant with accepting this person's offer because of their like track work record. This person may have like a. Um, they have a 
a reputation for being a player. Yeah. And so you might be a little bit hesitant to deal with them, but I'm getting soulmate vibes here, uh, um, Cancer. Definitely. It might be you that's not sure if you should go forward with this person or not. They feel like, um, yeah, the Ten of Wands. Yeah, with the Five of Wands on the bottom. Okay, so, yeah, that's the vibe that I'm getting. Some of you might not know this person or you may be like a uh, acquaintance of this person. You may know of this person. However, um, this person is the type of... Um, People think that they're a player, and they very well might be. I feel like this is someone that's been a bachelor for, for a while. Um, you don't fully trust it, though, Cancer. They're afraid of rejection from you. Despite them being a player, despite them, you know, getting whoever they want, they want you, number one, Cancer. And number two, they feel like um, you might not deal with them because of their reputation. So I feel like they have a reputation for kind of being in and out of women's lives. And um, you may even see them on social media posting different girlfriends all the time. You know, they, they get in relationships and situations. And they're only with them for like two months and then they're with another person. So I feel like you're kind of hesitant. I, f I see it working out though, Cancer. They feel like you're everything that they want and everything that they need. I see it working out though for you. You may feel like too, uh, Cancer, with this five of wands on the bottom, you might feel like um, you're going to end up having to compete for this person's time and attention, but you don't have to worry about that. That's not what I'm seeing. I feel like this person, once they make the decision to be with someone, they're with them. Now, they might play the field because I feel like ultimately this person is a bachelor. They're not really uh, big on commitments or relationships, but I feel like they're willing to take that leap with you, Cancer. So I feel like for a lot of you, this is a new person. Keep an open mind, Cancer. Yeah, see? Spirit saying keep an open mind because like I said, Cancer, you might reject this person because of their reputation. But they only want you, uh, Cancer, despite, you know, what they've done in the past. <laughs> Take it how it resonates, okay? Yeah, see, this deception comes out, and that comes out over the Four of Cups. See what I'm saying, Cancer? You don't, you don't trust anything this person says. You don't trust this person, Cancer. And I feel like it's because of how they come across in the public eye. You probably looked through, um, you went through there. This person may have already DM'd you. And you probably like scroll and scroll through their uh, social media profile and saw a bunch of different women and saw them partying and doing the most and all that. And you're like, mm, I don't think I trust uh I don't trust such and such. Such and such goes through too many women or too many men. I don't think I want to deal with such and such. Yeah, attraction. This person is extremely attracted to you. I'm going to pull a card for the deception. <clears throat> but I'm not really seeing any ill will, uh, Cancer. I definitely do see this person was a player at one point. I definitely see that. Okay, they may still be a player. But I feel like once... Once they come together with you, I feel like they're actually, they are going to actually um, try and be with you. You might be able to tame this uh, person, Cancer, whereas nobody else has been able to. Seriously? So the Queen of Pentacles comes out again, guys. Y'all have the Queen of Pentacles under deception. So, Cancer, you might feel like this person is married. Or you feel like this person's in another connection. 
the two of swords see you i feel like cancer you're the one in your head about this connection you might feel like this person's married the chariot comes out yeah that's that's y'all's energy i gotta dig deeper because i gotta know now what the hell so the knight of swords is here guys and the knight of swords is coming out the knight of swords is coming out again yeah you got i feel like cancer this person is going to going to prove themselves to you this person is going to try to prove to you that that's not what that's not the case you might think this person was married or that they're that they're committed because of something that you've seen from this person or you might feel like they have a whole bunch of other options and they're entertaining a whole bunch and they very well may be <laughs> said the pinnacles comes out as well yeah they're they're going to put in the work with you uh cancer definitely and they very well may be um entertaining other people while they're single because the king of wands like i said is a bachelor this is somebody that likes to play the field and the knight of wands you definitely heavy fire sign energy but i feel like once you get with this person they're not going to be that way i'm picking up a lot of good energy and i feel like cancer this might have be somebody you even uh turned down before because of this uh because of their reputation yeah, it could be a Pisces for some of you. Yeah, I'm, I'm not seeing any anything out of the way, Cancer. I feel like you you might just be um, overthinking it. Take it how it resonates. Yeah, Ten of Cups comes out. <clears throat> yeah, I feel like you might just be um, overthinking it cancer take it out resonates okay because they may they may well have a bunch of uh women or men but i feel like once you come into the picture yeah see when i was about to say it look what look what flipped over the queen of swords it's, it's another card behind there i'll show you guys yeah this i keep seeing the six of wands so as soon as i was about to say this the, the queen of swords comes out with the six of wands i feel like as soon as you guys make things official they're going to cut these other options off five of cups on the bottom yeah again we keep seeing this yeah soon as soon as you guys become official they're going to cut these other options off and i feel like this person is going to be very persistent too um with with courting you and trying to date you cancer all right but of, of course always use your own discernment and your own intuition okay so cancer that's y'all's reading if it resonated hit that like hit that subscribe you guys i appreciate you guys so very much till next time peace out